All right, let's take a look at this question. Now this just wants the intercept. I do have the slope formula and the slope intercept and linear equations up here just in case you see something like this and they need to know the equation. But let's take a look how to do this problem. So remember, the x and y intercept is like the easiest problem. We want them to give you 20 questions of x and y intercept. Here's the letter x. The x intercept is whatever crosses that line. Usually the x intercepts mean more when it comes to quadratics, which are the u-shaped graphs. So this is my x-intercept. Why? Because it's on the x-axis. I know. Crazy, huh? Let's take a look at this next one. Here's my letter y. This is the y-axis. It wants the y-intercept. My y-intercept is whatever place my graph crosses the y. There you go. Four. That's the answer. Now, it's going to want to know the actual point. It doesn't want to know the 4. So let me give you a little bit of a hint. For the y-intercept, that means the y is 4 and the x is just 0. If it said the x-intercept, then in this case, because it's the x, we put the number where the, on the axis, so negative 2, and the other one would be 0. That's done. So the correct answer for this would be 0, 4. Now, let's pretend it said write the equation. If it said write the equation, then what we're just going to do is our y equals mx plus b. We know our b value is positive 4. We just need to know our slope. And remember, for our slope, which is represented by the letter m, it is rise over run. So if I start here, I climb four spaces, and I go over two spaces. Four divided by two, four divided by two is two. Don't forget the x. Now, so the answer is zero, four. Go over zero, just jump four in the air. That's the intercept. So make sure you put it like that. Now, if you're not good at knowing if it's zero, four, or four, zero, or something like that, once you create this equation, you could go into Desmos and type it in. I'll just show you real quick. And so I'm just going to type in in the graphing calculator y equals 2x plus 4. And I can click on here and it'll tell me. Okay. I mean, you could type in any equation and it'll tell you like that the 0 comes first and then the 4. All right. Okay. Bye, guys.